Hi everyone and welcome back to Raven's Dollhouse. Today I'm going to be doing an outfit change on little baby Toulouse. And here he is. For you, uh, for those of you who don't know, he is the Taylor kit by Denise Pratt. And he is my one and only custom. He's a little, little tiny preemie. <laughs> and... When I first purchased him, when I first, you know, did the custom, I was still very, very new into Reborns. And I have to say that getting him, honestly, really, you know, it almost made me just not have much interest in Reborns anymore. It, I, I, I can't say I'll ever get a custom again, you know, but for those of you who have been on my channel a long time, you know I've already posted a video about that. So I'm not going to dwell on that. I still love him. He still means a lot to me. I have a thing for little redheads. So he's still my little baby. But I definitely have not considered getting a custom since this. And it, it was just a little bit heart-wrenching for me. So as you can see, he's very, very tiny. He's a very tiny preemie. He's got very, very soft vinyl, though. He's really, really squishy, and I really like it. So today I'm going to be dressing him in this little tiny alligator outfit, little alligators on the toes. But I also bought, brought a backup outfit, a little fire truck shirt and a little fire truck pants with a fire truck on the booty. Because a lot of times I do not like to put my babies in clothes with the little footy pajamas. Um, personally, just because to me that my favorite part on a reborn is actually their feet. And I think he has such, such cute feet. And I love all my Reborn's feet. And I just hate to cover them up because I really like to look at them. But at the same time, the footy pajamas are really, really cute. So sometimes I'll either get them and actually cut the feet off and just hem it up. So it's just like a little short, you know, pants. Or sometimes I leave the feet on and sometimes I just try and make it work. <laughs> So that's why I brought the backup outfit, and also just because he is so tiny that sometimes even preemie stuff does not fit him. So you always have to be careful when you dress him, because he is very difficult to fit clothes in. But as I talked last time, um, I was telling you about the, the new baby I was expecting, and I did get her over the weekend, and she was absolutely amazing. Um, I will have to do a video on her soon, but to be honest, I'm almost scared to do anything more than an introduction video. Like, I almost don't know if I want to do an outfit change, because she came to me. Her hair was perfect. Everything was perfect. And she has a lot of hair, and it's in two little pigtails, and it's just the sweetest thing. And I can't really do hair, like, at all. So part of me is worried that I will mess it up. So I'll definitely do an introductory video of her. Whether I do an outfit change is questionable. But she is awesome. She's so big. And I really, really love her. So I'm really excited to show you guys her. But I just wanted to dress a little Toulouse tonight. Because he hadn't gotten dressed in a while. So I felt like it was his time to get some attention. So as you can see, this outfit is pretty, pretty roomy. It doesn't look baggy. Um, it fits a lot better than other stuff does. I have a real hard time finding stuff that covers up his neck because he really doesn't have a neck. He just kind of has a chin. So it really has to go like all the way up. And he's got red hair. And he was supposed to have blue eyes, and when I got him, he has purple eyes. Doesn't really pick up on camera, but he does have purple eyes. And again, for any of you guys who are new followers, you can check out his introductory video and see about all the issues I had with him. But so this is Toulouse's little outfit for now. I do think I'm going to keep it on because I do really like the alligator feeties. They're really cute. And then if you didn't see, um, I have little Sully here for his stuffy. 
and then his little blankie has monsters on it. So I, I kind of kept, not with the dressing, because like I said, it's so hard to find clothes that fit them. But with the bedding and the stuffed animals, I like to keep them themed to being my little monster. Because he really is so itty bitty. Him and Marissa are my two tiniest babies. Alright. So we got him all dressed up and cute with his little grunting face. I just pacifier. <laughs> this is the only pacifier I have. And it's so big for his little face. Like, I really need to get him a new pacifier. Because it's so big. <laughs> but this is little Mr. Toulouse. And we really like that you guys came and saw him. So I hope to bring you guys a video soon of the new baby. So hope to see you then.